Networking like a pro. Okay. Move over for you. So it's by Yvonne Misner and Brian Hillard. And throughout, you get these like notes, like gray boxes with either Ivan or Brian in them. Each one will have a little picture of them and like their name and There'll, there'll be some sort of profi profile or story in them. So, not exactly relating to the topic, but somewhat relating to the topic. If you get it, if you get what I'm saying. Or if you've already read the book. You already know. So, there's five parts, 37 chapters, and there's two appendices. I think that's the plural for appendix, appendices. So there's that, and they have four steps to start the process of networking. So they explain that and then go into the networking of it all. <laughs> That's what the book is about. Then you get different figures like worksheets or charts. And you got the VCP process, visibility, credibility, and profitability. So what do those three things say about you, how you network, and what your presence is like in person? Because there are you have to network in person and online in this day and age you have to do both so what is your vcp process like in person and online and it does and this book does talk about both the physical and the physical face-to-face -face networking and the online online networking like linkedin twitter facebook and so on so you got those so is this in the straight person-to-person -person networking system or a uh, straight online networking? And it has a mix of both. So if you're just looking for one or the other, this is a good like start off point or like kind of like a mix. But if you want something that's just one or the other, I'm sure there's a few dozen, if not more, books out there on either or. So, it gives a list, list of associ associations and networks um, as help for networking and how to navigate it. There's seven char characteristics that make a great networker, like a good listener or a positive, a positive attitude. You don't want to have, like that one connection be the bummer. <laughs> Though that bummer might be a good connection later on. So, all, and perspective kind of also comes into play depending on if you want that positive attitude of like, oh yeah, I like working that worth with that person or whatever. And you don't wanna be like good listening, like you wanna go like, oh yeah, yeah, oh, oh hey, blah -de blah when you, when the person says, oh, I haven't, I didn't connect with this person, and you're like, oh, oh, hey, blah -de blah they just talked about how they weren't a good connection, you bring them over and say, oh, have you met this person? Not a good listener. <laughs> and they have a chapter called the 12 by 12 by 12 rule. So, like, how do you look from 12 feet away? How do you come across 12 inches away and the first 12 words said out of your mouth? So, don't want to go, so you want the first 12 words out of your mouth to be okay, to be pretty good, and you don't want to look like a mess or like smell like a mess from across the room or like face to face <laughs> kind of thing. So, like, they talk about, like, creating a plan, making networking work, like, newsletters, appreciation events kind of thing. 
So, as I said, like they talk about building your own social capital with others in <coughs> your network. So that connection on LinkedIn could be those like two, one or two connections on LinkedIn or like Twitter or whatever can help you out more depending on how you use that connection or navigate through that. So randomly though, it gives a few sites and stuff and stuff you have to do to be sex successful at networking because you got to work at networking you can't just say hi can you be my connection to whatever place so gotta think about that so appendix a is a checklist of materials for developing your word of mouth campaign kind of thing and Appendix B is, do you not work like a pro? So you rate yourself in these different categories and I'll just tell you what kind of networker you are. It is very informative. There's a lot of stuff in here. So it doesn't go into depth about a whole lot. It's just like, here's a number of different things you could do to network. It's giving you they're giving you multiple different things to do to network and like different types of resources and like tips, tricks kind of thing. So it is very informative if you are a person that wants to have a look at quite a different option, different options of how to network. This could be the book to have a look at. And if you want, a, again, a site variety of the physical and online networking process this is a book to have a look at and yeah it may look like a whole lot of a lot of stuff in it but there are different you don't have to take everything to be everything to heart with like oh I have to the book said to do this but if you aren't but you don't like have to do it if a lot of you networking is online and not very physical or vice versa but a lot of networking now is online so there's that introduction so networking like a pro by Yvonne Misner and Brian Hillard happy readings <laughs>